The second candle of the Advent season is known as the candle of peace. So as we prepare for Christmas, the Christian celebration of Jesus coming into the world, we remember that Jesus is our source of peace. Through the prophet Isaiah, God declared that peace would be brought into the world through Jesus. For unto us a child is born, to us a son is given, and the government will be upon his shoulders, and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Of the greatness of his government and peace there will be no end. He will reign on David's throne and over his kingdom, establishing and upholding it with justice and righteousness from that time on and forever. The zeal of the Lord will accomplish this. Jesus not only brought peace into the world, he was given the title as ruler of peace. Jesus was given the position of power over peace. That means he and he alone is responsible for how peace is distributed and how it is used. Peace belongs to Jesus. And so he gave it to those who followed him. In the Gospel of John, Jesus said, I have said these things to you, that in me you may have peace. In the world you'll have tribulation, but take heart, I have overcome the world. The prophet Isaiah said, You will keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed on you, because he trusts in you. And King David said, the Lord gives strength to his people. The Lord blesses his people with peace. And even as he prepared to leave the earth, Jesus told his people, peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you. Not as the world gives do I give to you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. This season, as we prepare for the coming of Jesus, Let's not forget that we're celebrating the gift of peace in His coming. True peace is found in no other name.